Uh, next, we'll be testing the elbow flexors in the gravity plane. The individual should be stable either in a sitting or standing position. The shoulders should be adducted. The palm of the hand should be facing forward, and you should be stabilizing the humerus. We'll be asking the person to give their best effort. But before we do that, let's see what the available range is. Okay. Now, when we ask the individual to give their best effort, if they're able to move actively less than 90 degrees, the grade that we award is a 2 plus. If they're able to do more than 50%, but less than full, the grade that we would award is a 3 minus. If their best effort allows them to go through full range and can't take any other resistance but the weight of the arm, the grade that they would earn is a 3. Being able to move through full range with this minimal amount of resistance, the weight of two fingers, the grade would be a 3 plus. If they're able to move through a full range against a moderate amount of resistance, the grade would be a 4. And if they can move through a full range against maximal resistance, the grade would be a 5.